Hello internet, welcome to Wednesday. Pretty nostalgic feeling, just randomly chatting on the way to work. But uh, I just wanted to mention, part of the reason that the vlog is not out today is because I had to export it overnight. And technically it was ready, uh, but it was still exporting and I have to be in work early today. So I'm not really able to, um, not really able to get it out, <laughs> which is a little disappointing, but that means it'll just be out Thursday, 2.45 p.m., which is like the regular time, which means I could send people there after stream, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> we'll see. In any case, I have work. It's going to be a long day because I'm going in early, and then I have to walk to work because everybody's nobody's home yet is a little disappointing because it is hot very hot but we'll make do I'll try to uh, I'll try to get a a nice drink when I get there sometimes I forget how much a really long day can take out of you because that last clip was on the way to work right? And that would have been like 12.45-ish, because I had to be in work at 1, right? So I then worked the 9-hour shift after being in the hot. And the heat takes a lot out of you. So I spent a lot of the day, like, kind of moving a little slow because I just I was tired it, it the heat heat sucks <laughs> so I'm tired and the, because of that I, I'm going to bed early ish it's only like 11 30 and normally I'm in I don't go to bed till like one sometimes two but I'm just tired enough that it's like I should just go to bed. <laughs> I already have everything that I wanted to get done tonight done. Except for feeding the dogs, because I'm waiting on them to finish eating. But otherwise, I'm, I'm good to go. So I'm, I'm just gonna start heading to bed and... Hope that tomorrow's better. And less exhausting. We'll see. So I'm doing something a little bit unusual, and that is uploading the VOD of a stream the same day that it happened. And I'm actually just gonna put this on private and deal with it later. But the um, the VOD is the only one that's not up yet. <laughs> Like, I have everything up to part 6, which was the 11th. All of that's scheduled. So, it's just this one that needs to, to be scheduled. So, I'm going to try to keep these releasing as they happen. Which saves me time in the long run, because then I won't fall behind. And as I get through the backlog, I'll be caught back up. But let me talk more about what we did today. Uh, we did a couple of side things, including, uh, beat up a quick and easy side boss. Um, not too bad. Got us a decent, uh, item that is helpful-ish. Uh, but really the main thing was, uh, chapter six, right? Yeah, chapter six. And we played through all of chapter six in addition to doing some side some preparation beforehand and that's good because that means we're still making good progress but I do still I am I'm starting to worry because looking at my work schedule for my day job um, I don't have a lot of days uh, coming up that I'm gonna be able to stream Paper Mario I'll still have stream time I just don't know when I'll be able to stream Paper Mario specifically. 
because like normally I do Tuesday, Thursday. We can start late on Tuesday, and that'll be chapter seven. Uh, because I'm off on Tuesday, but after that, I work on Thursday. I have truck on Wednesday. I could theoretically do it after truck, but that would be a little rough, but I could do it if I needed to. And then I'm working both Tuesday and Thursday the week after. So, <laughs> it's, uh, it's looking to be a little rough. Looking to be a little rough. I don't know what we're gonna do. We, we do have to figure this out sooner rather than later, but yeah, no, it's gonna be, it's gonna be playing it by ear a lot, and hopefully the week after that we'll go back to having one or both of those days off so that we can just finish the game, and then I can use that time to, like, do some level grinding just to get myself up a few more levels just to make sure I don't struggle with the end of the game. Um, it would be nice to not have to worry about that. <sighs> we'll see how it goes, though. But definitely worth, uh, definitely worth, like, sitting down and trying to figure it out as we go. Fortunately, I don't have any, any of my, uh, work schedule past that yet. Just, ugh. But we'll see. Like I said, we don't have a ton of game left, but the sooner we get it done, the better, because that means less chance of it, uh, going unfinished. Hi, welcome to Friday. So there is actually a thing that happened today that I completely forgot about. Um, me and a couple of friends, we went and did another Archipelago run. Uh, this time I played Super Mario 64. I did have to take down the VOD because of iffy subject material. I don't like getting political. There was some political discussion during the stream, so I decided to pull the VOD. Um, but overall it went pretty good, and I do still have the local recording. So that will probably come to plays at some point. Maybe cutting out the political talk. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Me and Luna together at some point. We'll figure that out. But, um, it was fun. Uh, there were like eight of us. We played a bunch of different games. Uh, and it lasted a good seven hours. Six and a half. Because some people were stubborn and dis and kept insisting that they would play. And it wasn't worth it because they left. But they had all of their important, all of the important stuff. Yeah. But overall, uh, it was fun and it went a lot better. I, I felt like I had a lot more I could do with Mario 64 than I did Ocarina of Time. And I'll, part of that has to do with the fact that I got all three keys right away. So I could go pretty much everywhere in the castle from the get-go, which helped a lot. But overall, it was a good time, and I will definitely do it again, probably with a smaller group. Maybe cap it at like four. So me and a couple of buddies of mine, we came out to the nearby flea market and like mini strip mall thing. For all that vlog and grind stuff. Always. Always. Never stops. Uh, they also had an arcade inside and we stopped in there. We didn't spend much time because I do have work in a little bit. But now we're looking for food because we're fucking hungry. <laughs> Disappointingly, none of the food stalls in there took card. So we gotta find something else. So I didn't end up getting anything while we were out. But I did end up getting something today, and that something is this from Tee Public. This is a shirt of all of the party members of Xenoblade 1 just chilling at the pool. 
It's really nice. I like getting as many Xenoblade shirts as I can because, well, one, I just really like Xenoblade, but two, a lot of the art that they come up with for these shirts are really cool. Like this one with the party chilling at, either at the pool or in the, in the, at the beach. Uh, and then we also have, um, that artwork that I wear often of Rex and Pyra, and then there's one of the third form, and then there's just a lot of cool art. And I'm, I'm really excited that Xenoblade continues to get love every day. But, you know, I don't really have much else, but I did get that today. <laughs> um, I was hoping to find something at the, at the flea market stuff, but it is what it is. We did stop at the arcade, though, which was really cool. Um, they had a lot of pinball tables and then a bunch of assorted other stuff, but, uh, for what it is, it's actually pretty cool. Um, that, that particular thing is, like, both indoors and outdoor storefronts. Most of the outdoor stuff is more flea markety, while the indoors are, like, actual proper stores. But, uh, definitely worth, uh, stopping by every now and again. It's been a while since I've been there, though. It's been, like, two years. But what? But Kevin hit me up and was like, Hey, I'm thinking of looking for Wii games. I'm thinking of stopping at the flea market. You want to come? And I'm like, yeah, why not? So we did. Anyway, that's it. I don't feel great, so I'm going to go to bed and skip out on the stream tonight. Sorry to kill, but... Yeah. <laughs> So I have these two baskets here, and to try to cut back on these baskets, I bought a thing. A little pop-up hamper. So I'm gonna open this up, put it somewhere, try to put away the clean clothes, and then put the dirty clothes in here. So other than the fact that it just smacked me in the face, it popped up real quick. So now I'm gonna get rid of the clean clothes and put the dirty clothes in the hamper. Okay, that's one. Ham uh, basket down, hamper is set up with dirty clothes in it, and this still also needs to be folded. This is going to save me time in the long run and prevent me from having too many of these pile up. And now that these are empty, that cuts some of the clutter out of my room. Granted, there's still a lot, but you know, I'll get there. Progress is progress. So as you can see, I have these two Mario Sunshine uploading, but they are like also like scheduled, right? So I updated the checklist, and this is kind of what I mean by um, having it show like every step of the way. Like these two are sitting in Media Encoder about to be run. These are all uploaded or uploading and these two are scheduled for when they're gonna release. Being able to like keep track of where everything is as I'm trying to go through them is like the entire point. And I wanted to talk about it again when I started going through Sunshine, it's, instead of just having the completely blank thing, just to, sh just to like give a better idea of everything that needs, of, of the way that it helps me keep track of things. And obviously it needs to be used to be able to do that, so. I needed to start going. So those two are scheduled, and I'm gonna try to schedule the rest and then get those started. Um, hopefully uh, it doesn't take too, too long to get the other two exported, but progress is being made. And that's that's the main thing, trying to like get through the rest of the backlog. I'm, I'm getting there, I'm getting there. After Sunshine, I'm gonna do Torna and then Future Connected, but we're getting there. So we did a uh, stream today of Paper Mario, and we finished chapter seven, which is great, because that means we have all the crystal stars. But it's bad, because that means the game's almost over. <laughs> and I'm enjoying the game a lot. Like, I tend to have trouble, like, showing how I'm feeling during streams, but I'm genuinely enjoying the game. Um, and so, I'm looking forward to the end of the game, but I'm also going to be sad that it's over. Um, but ultimately, it's going to be a... It, it's been a good time, so... 
it shouldn't be too big a deal that we are over. But, um, there were definitely some interesting characters along the way. But, uh, and, and really weird moments as well. Hmm. Hmm. Anyway, uh, the game is, is looking to end really well, and I'm looking forward to... Uh, I'm looking forward to playing more. I'm looking... I'm not looking forward to it being over. I might replay it. I don't know. I know there's a lot that I didn't do on first go. Uh, but I might, like, replay it in my own time. Just because I'm having a lot of fun with it. But that's neither here nor there. I'll figure it out what I want to do there another time. Anyway. It's Tuesday. It's about 9 o'clock, so I'm gonna have to start hitting a bed soon. So, I'd like to thank you all for watching. Hope you have yourself a damn good one, and I'll see you.